To write the name for CAS, we first need to recognize what type of compound we have. Since calcium is a metal and sulfur is a nonmetal, a metal and a nonmetal, that's an ionic compound. And we have to think about the charge on the atoms here. Specifically, this is called a binary ionic compound. There's just two different types of elements. Because of that, we'll use these rules here to write the name for CAS. First, we'll write the name of the metal. That's the CA, just as it appears on the periodic table. So CA on the periodic table, that's calcium. Then we'll write the name for the nonmetal. That's the S, the sulfur, just as it appears on the periodic table as well. We'll start with a lowercase s. And then we're going to replace the ending with IDE. So instead of UR, we're going to call this IDE. So the name for CAS is calcium sulfide. If you needed to write the formula, you need to recognize that calcium is in group 2 on the periodic table, has a 2 plus ionic charge when it forms a bond here, and then sulfide is 2 minus. So 2 plus, 2 minus, they add up to 0. So the formula is CAS. This is Dr. B with the name and formula for calcium sulfide, CAS. Thanks for watching.